Hey guys, this is Kelly. I have uh, my February kit to share with you from the Wild Hair Kits. I am going to start with the papers. This is Jen Hadfield Along the Way Picnic Basket. Love this blue. And on the back is a great black and white print. This one is Along the Way by Jen Hadfield called Sweet Sentiments. And I am definitely going to be making some cards. They have the perfect little um, sentiments on them. And I wanted to beef up my card stash. So this is Along the Way. This pattern paper is Blooms. And I like both of those sides. This is also Jen Hadfield Along the Way Home. And that's a nice black and white floral. This one is One Canoe Tube called uh, Meadow Floral, and that's in the Goldenrod collection. Love this side. Not a fan of this color. Just not my cup of tea. But this is gorgeous. This is Echo Park Coffee. And this uh, pattern paper is called I Like Big Cups. This one is Echo Park Coffee Coffee Run. And that's just a nice fun side. This one is Heidi Swap Emerson Lane and this is called Easy Peasy. Love that polka dot. Um, another paper by uh, One Canoe Two in the Golden Rod collection. This is Pink Tile. And that's a great navy background. This is Amy Tangerine Shine On. This is Remember. And the last pattern paper is Jen Hadfield Patio Party, and this is called Panels. And that is the back. So along with all of these pattern papers, I did get the card making paper pad by Pink Paisley. This is Auburn Lane. And um, again, I have plans. I wanted to I don't make a lot of cards, but I really wanted to this year focus on using my stash for lots of different um, projects with layouts, traveler's notebooks, and cards. My cards will most likely be more patterned paper than stamping and that kind of thing, but you know, what better way to really use your stash? So here are the pattern papers with this collection. This is one of my favorite collections by Pink Paisley for their fall line. And like the fact that, you know, the way the size is that you can just actually flip it over and um, make your cards. It's the perfect size. So you will definitely be seeing some cards um, from this. Let's see, what do I wanna show next? Um, I'll do the die cuts. I did get the Jen Hadfield um, homemade die cuts. And these are not all. You get a total of 40 die cuts in the pack. But there's a few that are very similar. Like several of these um, leaves are, come in both the gold and the black and white. There's several different floral clusters. Um, so I tried to show the unique ones, you know, being the girls, um, the little teacup that are sweet, the birdhouse, um, because it was overwhelming when I showed all the different little um, leaves. So that is like the majority of the prints or of the different patterns that you get. Um, also, I received, let's see, from Freckled Fawn, these label stickers and these enamel uh, stickers. Love these pink color um, and it's perfect to go with both of the collections and let's see and this is another sequin kit. I love working with sequins just for that perfect little touch. These are exclusive um, for Wild Hair Kits by Spiegel Mom Scraps. Probably one of the most things that I was so excited for were these photo corners by Heidi Swap. You get um, 40 different pieces. There's five different colors. 
just wanted to show you the different colors that kind of yellow green a navy gold a cream and a pink so um, I used to use a lot of photo corners I think these are fun um, yeah so I'm excited for those and the last thing that I need to share with you let's see here let me pull out this pattern paper so I can show you are the wood veneers this is also from the homemade collection um, these are so these are my favorite wood veneer I'm going to use these on cards um, I just think they're so sweet there are a bunch of floral leaves that come in this uh, kit as well this is probably my favorite that wreath um, some houses little circles um, this is definitely something to get if you um, are interested in making cards or you know like like me want to beef up your card stash let's see and here's the last one love always so that's it this is my February kit I keep on wanting to say January but it's not it's my February kit and I hope to have a couple process videos for you soon so take care bye